the Arc de Triomphe. The Arc de Triomphe in Paris. The miniature one um, in Roseville, Kansas, was a uh, was originally built to honor uh, World War One soldiers. When the war ended, the Great War, um, in 1919, those who paid the greatest price and did not come home were honored with this monument. They were called the Rainbow Division because they were from a number of uh, counties in Kansas. So there was an architect who served over there, and he was drawing sketches of it when he was over there, and so he came up with this, you know, smaller version in Kansas. Well, the gentleman who designed this uh, was Leroy Marshall, and he served in World War I. He made sketches of the Arc de Triomphe in, in Paris. And when he came back, you know, he wanted to honor those who had fallen, and um, this was the design that was chosen. They started construction in 1921, the groundbreaking of the city of Roseville and then completed in 1923, dedicated to the memory of those who did not return from World War I. Actually, this monument is hollow. It's got um, a wooden structure inside, and it's built on this site. This is called Mount Marty, and right now it is uh, owned by the city of Kansas City, Kansas. A number of years ago, in 1993, the, another monument was added inside the arch, um, and it was rededicated in memory of all those who died in past wars. I think it's important always to remember um, those who gave the greatest sacrifice. It speaks to our history, it ties us to those who have come before us, and I think that's really important. If you only have monuments in faraway locations, it's, it's a, a distancing thing, you don't, it's not real. Uh, to be able to see it, and enjoy it and think about what's happened and what people have given uh, for us is important. <laughs>